Panathinaikos comes back in the final minutes by Taminga Seko Prokom, 74-66 at the Oaka. Despite a brave performance from Polish side, Pau take the decisive advantage in the last part of the fourth period and conquer an important victory to continue his first place run, while for Prokom everything it will be decided in the last round. Best scorers for Pau, Nicolas and Batiste with 13 points each, while Ewing scores 19 points for Prokom and Woods added 16. With a superb demonstration of power, Montepaschi dressed Fenerbahce 101-58 at Palamensana after a no-history game, where Tanevich's side managed to stay in contact only in the first period. Then, Tienijani's band flied away by doubling the opponents already at half-time, dragged by the magic performances by Cristof Lavrinovic, 20 points, 6 rebounds and 7 fouls received, coming off the bench. And an unstoppable David Hawkins, who posted 17 points and also 5 assists. The margin became even impressive in the fourth period when Siena arrived till a plus 47 advantage. On the Turkish front, only Greer, 18 points for him, and Savage, 13 points and 5 rebounds, defended the honor. Caja Laborale stayed in the race to win Group C by downing Marusi BC 73 65 in Vittoria. After a fast start from the visitors, led by Homan and Kaimakoglu, Ivanovic's side took control of the game and reached the tie at the end of the first half. A 15 nil run, propelled by the lead actor San Emeterio, closed the matter in favor of the Spanish club. As already said, San Emeterio and Teletovic were the best scorers with 15 points, while Splitter rolled in the paint with 14 points and 6 rebounds. For the Greeks, Dimitrios Mavroidis with 12 and Jared Homan with 11 were the two players to mention about. Real Madrid started the game playing really slow, allowing Goldberg to stay in the match until the end of the first half, 34-30. Turning point has been the end of third quarter, when Bullock, with three consecutive three-pointers, gave to Real a good lead of 11 points and practically killed the game. Lavrinovic, 16, and Bullock, 15, best scorers for Real. For Oldenburg, Polding, 12, Szczekic and Foster with 11. With this win, Real has a record of 7-2, still battling for the first position. Oldenburg remains 1-8. What can you say more about Partizan? This amazing team, despite the injury of Alexander Maric in the second quarter, destroyed Lietovos Ritas, recovering the goal average and reaching the third place of the Group B. Just take a look on the ridiculous difference in the statistical evaluation, 134-38, to understand how impressive was the performance of Vujovic's guys. Shooting very well the ball, 70% by 2 points, 11 out of 24 by 3, the home team dominated the game with a devastating fourth quarter. 25 to 6. Closed by the triple of Dushan Ketsman to set the final score at the buzzer.